Well, hey everyone, welcome back. Today we're going to be treating all the broadleaf, um, all the broadleaf weeds that are in in the lawn in preparation for spring because spring is not far away. Oh, it's not far away um, until we do those renos, get things looking smick. Um, first, we're going to treat our broadleaf weeds. So. I shall be using um, just Hortico Weed Killer from Bunnings. Um, that will knock out all the broadleaf. It won't knock out the winter grass. Um, I'll get another herbicide for that in a couple of weeks or whatever and spray the winter grass out. I don't think it sprayed out winter grass. I'd be surprised if it does because this only does broadleaf um, weeds, not grassy weeds. Um, and the active ingredient in this is di not dicamba because it's buffalo. It's MCPA and Bronomuxel. I forgot how to say that. Completely forgot how to say that. Bronomuxel. Bruno, I don't know. Anyway, now it's very important that the weeds aren't in the lawn um, because they are a competition for the lawn, for the grass, because it's gonna, the weeds are gonna compete and compete for water and nutrients and they're gonna be using that, um, which the grass needs as well. So it's gonna, they're both gonna be fighting against each other. And if the weeds set seed, then they'll spread even more and come back, they can come back the next year later even worse. Um, so it's very important that you get your weeds, spray them out or pull them out before they set seed. Otherwise, then you're gonna have a whole lot more than what you started with. Now you want to be spraying at around knee height. If you go any higher than that, then you, there's a chance that the product will get caught in the wind and it's not gonna go on your lawn and it's gonna go elsewhere and it could damage other plants. Or if you go too low, you'll be spraying too low and you could be putting too much of the product on the plant, which could also cause um, unwanted damage. It is now time to mix this up. Um, always read your labels, always weigh your PPE. Be a good boy, weigh your PPE. So it says 30 mil per five to 10 liters of water per 50 square meters. Now I've got around 55 square meters here, so round it down to 50 square meters for easy calculations. Always wear your PPE. PPE. All right, measure out 30 mil. Yeah, if I can get it open. It's one of those push down and twist ones, you know. A bit too much. This stuff isn't very strong at all, so you need a lot of it. We're in. The quick little trick. If you don't have a surfactant or a wetter or a sticker, whatever they're called, um, you can add a dash of dishwashing liquid. So you just add a drop and this will make the herbicide stick to the leaf um, for longer and be absorbed through the leaf so the herbicide's not, not just gonna run off the leaf and evaporate. So, quick little tip. Let's just mix this up real quick. Shaky, shaky. Well, we're all done guys. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I really do appreciate it. Um, hopefully, 
or this will knock out the weeds. Um, I'll spray the winter grass out if it doesn't die in an upcoming video later on. Um, but yeah, thank you all for watching. I really do appreciate it. Subscribe if you haven't already. Like this video and leave some comments too. I enjoy reading those. So thank you. See ya.